the heat zone by whip mix is an alternative means of heating up metal instruments by induction. It's a safe and economical way of heating up metal instruments because when it's on, unless there's something metal inside the web, there's no danger of a fire. You can stick your finger in the induction well when it's on, nothing will happen unless you have something metal on your finger. The only time that it will turn on is if you put something metal inside the well. To get started, plug it in and turn it on. When you turn it on, you'll note the heat zone symbol on the top lights up. When it's turned on and operational, you'll notice a green light down here. If the light is red, or if it's not green, or if it's flickering, it needs to be adjusted. To use the unit, I'd suggest using a finger rest or the edge of your hand as a rest down on the tabletop. Insert the instrument right into the center. If you're finding that it's not coming on, the light will stay green. If it's working, it'll turn red and you'll find that the instrument gets quite hot. Make sure not to touch the sides of the unit. There's a little plastic or rubber cap in here that keeps things clean. You'll melt that and it doesn't work very well if you use the instruments not in the center of the material of the instrument. So again, stick it in the center, put it in far enough that you see the light turn red, and then it should work. If you're finding that the sensitivity is not what you want, that can be adjusted. Over here on the side of the unit, you'll see a little sensitivity uh, adjustment. You can use just a Phillips screwdriver, one that comes with your Typodons. You can put that in and slowly move that right or left to get the adjustment that you need. As you make that adjustment, look down at the light down at the bottom here. If it turns red, it's not sensitive enough. It should be green when you've got it adjusted properly. It should also be adjusted so that when you put your instrument in, it turns red. If you put the instrument in the center and it doesn't turn red, you need to adjust the sensitivity. If you move the heat zone around a lot, you're probably going to have to play around with the sensitivity a little bit. But once you get adjusted, it works pretty well. Occasionally you can take out this rubber cap, clean it out so the wax doesn't build up, pop that back in, and you're ready to go.